you can't really oppose this, it seems to me, without being on the side of the mobs, of mob violence, of mob mentality, of cruel, cruelty and intolerance and terror. Now we understand what this resolution is about. I don't think one can oppose this without being comfortable with those things. These mobs are not progressive. These mobs are not enlightened. These not mobs are not edgy. They're not hip. They're frauds. President, They're dim-witted, phony drama addicts. Mr. President, uh, parliamentary inquiry. Is this line not in direct violation of Rule 19? The chair concludes that pointing out that mob violence is dangerous to our nation is not contrary to Rule 19 or any other rule the, of this. Further parliamentary inquiry. It's not a question of mob violence. The question is that imputing to members who did not agree with the framework and language of this resolution that they are supporting mob violence. That must be in violation of Rule 19 if this is going to be a deliberative body. <laughs> the senator is more than entitled to express his views in the course of debate. But other senators will likewise express their views in the course of debate. Failed by an education system and addled by a social media culture that taught them to be victims instead of citizens. A privileged, self-absorbed crime syndicate with participation trophy graduate degrees trying to find meaning in empty lives by destroying things that other Americans have spent honest, productive lives building. And today we learned, today we learned that there are those who are comfortable with this. There are those who are at least not inclined to vote for this resolution, which simply condemns mob violence. Some people are still, look like they're still remaining here. Most of the crowd is dispersing now.